Hi, I'm your Dave. Today we're gonna cook chicken biryani and chicken patiala. But for a change, my sister gonna cook. So let's see. This one for rice cooking part. First of all, we need to pour water. Okay, the water need to be below the five milliliter level. Depends on your rice cooker, guys. For the second part, we're gonna add some spices. The spices gonna use is biryani leaf, cardamom, clove, and cinnamon. Third step will be adding salt. Guys, I'm using this Himalayan salt, guys. Next is ginger garlic paste, guys. Next, we're gonna add some ghee. Okay, guys, next, we're gonna mix it well. Mix, 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 mix. Now, we're gonna marinate the chicken, guys. So, let's see what the ingredients we're going to use. Chili powder, turmeric powder, Himalayan salt, biryani masala, garam masala, black pepper, coriander masala, yogurt. First, add in some salt. Second, add some turmeric powder. Third, add some chilli powder. Next will be biryani masala. Next, garam masala. some black pepper and then coriander masala last will be yogurt Mix it well guys, mix, mix, mix and keep mixing. After mixing guys, you can add some lemon juice. We're gonna marinate one hour guys. Okay guys, we're gonna cook chicken patella. So let's see what the ingredients we're going to use. Chili powder, turmeric powder, Himalayan salt, blended chili paste, onion, tomato, ginger garlic paste, cashew nut paste, spices, coriander leaf, pudina leaf, yogurt and finally all type of spices first add some oil first add some spices next onion stir until the onion will become golden brown next 
ginger garlic paste. After your onion becomes golden brown, you must add ginger garlic paste, guys. Next, add the chicken. So you can uh, cut the chicken into pieces, guys. So it will be nice. Let's mix it right. Next, turmeric powder. Add salt. Next, add some chili powder. Add chili paste. Add some paprika to get some spicy taste. Add some garam masala guys. Add some cashew nut paste. So this cashew nut paste will make your chicken patella more creamier. Add some yogurt. Next, put some green chilies and put the flame low until the chicken fully cooked. Lastly, add some pudina leaf and coriander leaves. The chicken patella is ready for the biryani. Next, let's start cooking biryani. Okay guys, we're gonna cook biryani now. Let's start. First, pour some oil. Okay, next, add some biryani spices. Next, add some onions. Next, stir the onions until it turns to golden brown. Next, add some ginger garlic paste. Okay, next add some chili paste. Add the marinated chicken. Add little bit of salt for seasoning. Add some garam masala. Add some coriander powder. Don't put too much guys, later it will be bitter. Next, add some biryani masala. Add some tomato. Put some coriander leaf and podina leaf. Add some green chilies. Add some yogurt. Let the chicken in low flame in about 10 minutes. Okay guys, the chicken is ready. So we need to add rice. Okay guys, now adding rice time. Okay guys, the trick is do not press the rice. Just level up the rice using the spoon. If you press the rice, you can't get the puffiness of the rice. Add little bit of coloring for the rice to look nice texture. Okay, now add some pudina leaf and coriander leaf. Add some fried onions. Mm. 
finally add some ghee let the biryani cook well now let's close the lid okay guys the biryani is cooked well now add some fried onions The Chetina Chicken Biryani is ready to be served and with Chicken Patella. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe. Signing off, Dave. Bye bye.